It was a good week. Uh, still a lot of things we're working on, a lot of things we have to fix, but uh, the guys are excited to play. What are some of the challenges with narrowing down your first travel roster, especially with only getting 70 guys? There's, there's really no challenge there. We, we uh, do the same thing at home games, take a certain number of people to the hotel, so it won't be any different. How further along is Adrian Martinez compared to last week? Uh, he's, he's further along. Um, again, it isn't just is he ready to go, it's is he ready to go to mentally and physically to the point that he can protect himself in the game and make sure he stays healthy. So he, he's really close. Um, we got to make a final decision. But he's going to make the trip either way. Yeah, he'll be there. How have you seen Andrew you know, take his first start and kind of grow from that film this week and have that after playing the way he did? Uh, Andrew's going to keep getting better just like everybody else on our team. Um, that was his first ever start. There was some good, there was some bad. Um, he's got to keep improving like everybody else. The more reps he gets, the better he'll get. What do you want to see from your special teams this week, Scott? Improve play. What do you learn when you take a team on the road for the first time, especially a team that you're in your first year with? What do we learn? Yeah, about, about your team on the road. Uh, you know, there's so many little things that we have to make sure are right Culturally, I remember when I first got here, um, Bill Moose talked to me about being on a road trip at the end of last year and getting off the plane and not ever in his life seeing a, a plane with so much trash left on the plane. Um, sounds like it shouldn't matter in the game. Those things matter because those are little things. When guys are attentive to do things right, um, little things are done right all the time, including in games. So we have a lot of lessons to continue to teach them. I'm sure there's things that will come up on the road trip that we'll have to continue to teach them. But um, those things take a while, and, and it's a process. And I, we'll fix those as they come up. I'm more worried about getting the team as ready as they can be to play this game. Uh, you faced uh, their defensive coordinator back in 2016, uh, Don Brown. What, what, what's challenging about the way he calls a game and, and what he calls it with those players? Uh, he's got good players to work with, and they have good scheme. They take away just about everything easy that should be there, and they make you earn it. They're going to play hard. Um, I'm sure if we're playing a, a young quarterback or a backup quarterback, uh, they'll be coming over the walls on blitzes, so we have to be ready for all that. Scott, Aaron Williams earned a black shirt this week. What was he showing you coming back from that injury the way he did in mid-August to get to that point? Uh, he's done things the right way. you know. He, he was hurt, and we didn't get to see him for a long time. Uh, and then he had to come back and prove it. He's done a good job of that. Uh, we got to see him continue to, to do that. Look, these black shirts that are handed out, um, they're, they're not bought. They're, they're rented. Um, it, it's a week-to-week -week thing, and they got to continue earning it. But he's done a, a really good job the first two weeks. Coach, how much do you play up the underdog rule? How much do you embrace that? Uh, we're going to be underdog in quite a few games this year, so I, I'm not going to tell the guys they're not as good as the other team. I'm not going to embrace that at all. I just want to go out and, and play as hard as we can and fight and uh, be better than we were last week, regardless of who we're playing. Are there any uh, season-ending injuries that you've been reporting? No. no. Hey, what does Tyjon Lindsay have to do to become a bigger factor? Uh, Listen, I, I'm not going to talk too much about individuals. He's got a ways to go just like a lot of other guys. Um, th there's got to be attention to detail. There's got to be effort from a lot of guys. There's got to be um, more desire to be perfect in practice from a lot of guys. Um, we're continuing to get that fixed, but uh, you know, if you guys are waiting for me to talk about what's wrong with any individual player, I'm never going to throw one guy under a bus. It, it doesn't happen overnight. Um, this Thursday, I hope it's not anywhere near as good as next Thursday and, and Thursdays down the road. Um, but we're continuing to improve, and uh, that's all we can do. So was, that, was it a disappointing Thursday? No.